What's up guys, Curtis here and welcome to a brand new episode of Nation Squad Builder. If you don't know what this is, this is a series where we are going from A to Z doing some slightly random nationalities, the ones that aren't necessarily the most popular nationalities to build and just building a squad out of it. Today we have G and that means Greece and Greece are amazing. This is the best squad I've used. This was quality. So before we get into it, what I do want to say is if you guys want a fast and reliable coin service, check out utcointraders.com. There is a link to them in the description down below. Now, uh, you're going to need to be getting those coins off of them if you want to build this squad. So let's get into it because it's amazing. That is, I just, I'm lost for words how sick this squad was. I've literally just finished using them just then. And it was just brilliant. So in goal, we have this Zorvas. This guy was all right. He wasn't really used a lot because, to be honest with you, the rest of the team was amazing. So in goal, we have Zorvas. Left back is where it starts to get serious. So we got Holobash. He did get sent off in our last game. But look at those stats. 90 pace. He's also got 91 shot power. 70 shooting, 73 passing. Just insane stats there for a silver. And then we have two solid, solid centre. But sorry, I'm getting a bit excited here. This team was so good, guys. I can't wait just to get you all using it. Socrates wasn't even getting full chemistry. I believe he was on eight chemistry sat here at the back. And still, he was a tank. Right centre back, we had Papadopadopoulos. So I have it. Papadopadopoulos. Sorry, that's the right amount of Dopadopoulos. Uh, anyway, we have 73 and 75 pace for these two centre backs. Un Unbelievable. 82 defending, 82 defending for both of them rather, and 83 heading. Both really, really solid. Right back, we have this guy, probably the worst player in the team, and he's still not bad. 79 pace is all he has to offer, but that's fine. The rest of the team is just perfect. Now, this guy is amazing. He has a beautiful long shot on him. Not Maniatis, as you might think it might be. Marinos, this guy is just beautiful he's a brilliant brilliant player 85 pace is really impressive for a defensive mid and he was just really really solid in that role for me and did a really good job like you saw there uh, you do also have Maniatis in case you need him uh, to fill that role but Man Marinos is the one that we will be using Right mid, we have Mavrias, another insane one. Really good long shots. This guy is just really solid out wide. Those stats just are really good for a silver. 86 pace particularly. Very, very nice indeed. Left mid, we have Giorgio Samaras. I love this guy. Again, he's an absolute tank. Absolutely massive. And still to have 83 pace is unbelievable. I'm sure last year he had like a an inform as a striker or something like that. But anyway, he is still really, really good. 73 dribbling, 71 heading, and is like six foot five or something insane and then we get into more of the big dogs here we got fit fat Zidis. everyone knows who this fella is five star skills 82 pace 81 dribbling an absolute beast in the center of the park there using his five star skills and the link up play with marinos here is just phenomenal they were just so good it was the bet i probably the best cams defensive mid partnership i've ever used it was just phenomenal and some of the players you could include in this if you didn't want to keep it just greek you could put quincy Owusu Bay here so many really cool players you could just make this team even better but um two strikers we have and not even going to try and say his name and this guy pulled a couple of really big goals out of the bag for me 78 pace 70 dribbling 73 heading and then obviously the big salping over on the right 87 pace 78 shooting and again another absolute tank of a player so we're going to just get this done really quickly get onto the gameplay and talk a bit more about the team over there so I, I guess I did really get quite a bit excited about this team I'm going to move away from the mic a bit as well because I feel I've been a bit loud but uh, I cannot stress to you guys enough how awesome this team was it's not very often I try a team out like this and just genuinely love it particularly one when there's team of the seasons in it usually I find myself hating the team but this it was just brilliant it was so good Holobash was amazing at the back the two centre backs are so overpowered with Socrates and Papadopoulos. So OP. Uh, the wingers, both from with Samaras and Mav Mavrayash, are both just perfect. I know I'm butchering all their all the accents for their names as well, but the two midfielders just. I cannot stress to you guys how awesome this team is. I want you genuinely to put your mouse down, your laptop down, your keyboard down. I want you to go pick up that controller of yours and go and buy this squad because I just. It was so good. I don't know why. It was a Greek squad, but everyone is just so overpowered in it. And I don't. Re FIFA's ending now. Go spend those coins. That's all I've really got to say. I guess that's the end of this episode, guys. I'm a bit lost for words of actually how good this team was. I don't. I don't really know anymore. So thanks for watching. I guess leave a like if you did enjoy it. Um, and if you want to see more of these, let me know in the comments down below. But thanks for watching. I guess. And this was just a good team. I guess weirdest commentary ever. Bye.